Greetings! Oh, I'm kidding. <laughs> Welcome to the Cosmic Show, hosted by me, Cosmic Chimp. And today we have a awesome guest with us, my partner in crime, part of the cosmically epic, Epic Tethys. Are you there? Shh. Where are you? Like, come on, like, like seriously, where are you? Oh, what have you done here? Right, so where are you? Hello? You'll never find me. <laughs> where are you? <laughs> no, I can't find you. Where are you? You're gonna have to jump out and give me a flight somewhere. Oh, scary mug right there. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, that's fun. I love these little plants. These are cool. So, boys and girls, the whole aim of this game is basically a chat show. This is my stage, and we're going to talk nonsense. And that's just how it is. <laughs> hey, you know what? As it turns out, nonsense is what I normally talk anyway, so that works out well. Right, so, epic, my man. Yes. Mm-hmm. What got you into YouTube? Ooh, that's a good question. Um, I don't know. What do you mean you know? Is that know. a good answer? <laughs> no, <laughs> <laughs> that's not a good answer. I try. You know, I remember it was Minecraft was the first thing that I posted with like the actual intention of other people seeing it, okay. and I had this thought that you know. Well, like everybody does. I'm going to become a famous YouTuber. No, I don't think I ever thought that. But um, but I thought, you know, it might be fun to record and then upload. Oh, no. I remember what it was. Just ignore everything. It, that, I mean, that's all true. But um, but no, I'm, I actually started by making a mod pack. Uh, I was making my own mod packs for um, Minecraft, mainly just for my friends, you know, because we were trying other mod packs and playing together. And, okay. And I wanted like a different set. Like I wanted this one and I wanted this one, but I didn't want that one. And nobody had that pack. So I thought, okay, I'll figure this out. I made a mod pack and was making a few of them. And I made one called Epic Tech that was kind of centered around the way I like to play games. So it was meant to be played on peaceful mode with no monsters. Okay. And which I, you know, because I'm not really all that into running around and killing things. I mean, that's fun, but. I'm more into creating crazy things like putting stuff together. And so it had all kinds of technical things and, and whatnot, but it didn't have any monsters. And I, I needed to introduce that mod pack. I was going to release it to the world, but I needed a video for that. And so I made a video to kind of highlight that. And then I thought, you know, it might be fun to do like a let's play series playing my own mod pack. Ooh. And yeah, yeah. And like my first video got like 20 views. And I unlike was like, your wow. videos nowadays. <laughs> <laughs> I think if you go back, that video, even now to this day, has like 100 views, even though most of my videos have like 10 times that. Wow. Um, I would actually yeah. like to play it one day. I yeah, be quite no, smart. I just need I mean, to... it's, it's based on an old version of, of Minecraft, but just it would still there. work. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you say. Do you know how hard it is to make a mod pack for mod <laughs> I don't know how to make mod packs, so pass. Yeah. It's not like <laughs> it's not like that big of a deal. I mean it's like a couple hours worth of work, but uh, but it's a couple of hours worth of work. But it would be fun to play Minecraft with it you would sometime. it would actually. i d I've always wanted to try those uh, minecarts. <laughs> oh, those are fun. Yeah. <laughs> okay, question number two. Why do I always like stand on your head? Um, because you think you can fly on another man's head, or you what? like you like to jump on my shoulders and get piggybacked. I just think it's <laughs> I think I just think it's funny being on a man. Right? Okay. Why? <laughs> really? Really epic. <laughs> uh, anyway, why did you choose the name Epic Deck or Epic Titus? Epictetus. Okay, yeah. so Epictetus, it comes from a first century Greek philosopher named Epictetus. And we share a lot of interests, even though we're a couple thousand years of art. Um, but his name is spelled with a C. And so I changed I, mine spelled with a K. Because in the real world, my name is Eric, and it's spelled with a K. <gasps> bum, bum, bum. 
boom. It's true. It's true. So it's Eric with a K, and so I thought it'd be kind of cool to have Epictetus with a K, and um, and there you go. Nice. Yeah, I like it. So you're all philosopher. Philosopher. I, I can't even say it. Now. <laughs> <laughs> I enjoy philosophy. That's, That's actually it. one of my yeah. It's one of my favorite like things is philosophy and analyzing the world around me. Uh, anyway, <laughs> so why Epic Tech? Why the channel Epic Tech? Why not just well, call it? So it was named after the mod pack because it was mainly a technical mod pack. So it was like Epic Tetis's technical mod pack, Epic Tech. And then I kept the channel name because that's kind of what I focus on is technical stuff. So Space Engineers, very technical. Um, and and I play technically like I like to get into all the nitty gritty of understanding how things work together and, you know, using the the rules of the game to beat the game as opposed to necessarily, you know, like a lot of gamers, it's more about their reflex and speed and and that kind of thing. Mine's more about understanding the technology about it and using that to my advantage do you know what i just love playing with you because you know all this stuff and i'm like with me i haven't got a clue where to start so usually oh, when that's you... not true you made this whole set this is beautiful <laughs> yeah like seriously wasn't i technical. love this well <laughs> no but see that's the thing is i need to partner up with people that can do this kind of thing because <laughs> i'm so technical i can't make anything look good well, yeah, don't, don't, let's have a wee look around the base. So let's go outside first. So um, here's the Cosmic Show sign. This is going to be like the Hollywood sign. Amazing. Just there. It's like a cloud in space. We have up here is the actual dome with the, the skylight. <laughs> well, of course, with all your famous curves. Famous curves, of course. We have the stairs at the back. Stairs? Yeah, there's stairs. And oh, here, the inside stairs. Yeah, yeah, the inside ones. And this is the patio. <laughs> yes. Oh, brilliant. Barbecue. I don't actually have a barbecue. Or what? as uh, certain people would like to say, braai. It's not a... What? A what, braai. What did you just say? A What's braai? a braai? Well, that's as Africans call a barbecue. A braai. Well, they're, they're calling it wrong. <laughs> have a word to tire with that one. <laughs> so in here... I just... What? The funny thing is, is like I, I love like intercultural stuff and all that, but it's really fun just to say oh, things like that. Definitely. Any hoodles, my noodles? <laughs> I hate Commander <laughs> Kittens for that. <laughs> I love it. So this is my arrow. Uh, the point is to the downstairs basement. Sure. So any <laughs> oh, an arrow, nice. You like it? You know, you see yeah, that? Yeah, cool. We have program. I you. Tinted everything orange. I mean, it's like painfully orange in here. You know it. That's how it is. Even the lights are orange. I know. <laughs> so I can't even find orange. you because you're just basically orange up against orange. <laughs> so where'd he go? Where is he? Somewhere around here. Okay, moving on. So we've got timer blocks and programmable blocks, and I'll be adding more things in here. But this is just basically if anybody's got scripts that they want to show off or any other technical things we can put them in and then show them up on the screens upstairs also that one and this is you doing your famous circle movement in the space because why well why not <laughs> <laughs> and, and since when is this famous <laughs> i don't know any hoodles coming down here and here's just the this is the changing rooms the dressing rooms when everybody comes in here <laughs> right, let's get up here. So this show will be basically everybody and anybody from my Discord will be able to well, our Discord because I'm just bumping off yours, <laughs> which is great. The Epic Tech, you know, the, that's the other thing that I actually like. One of these days, <laughs> I'm gonna work out because Commander Kitten and I've been talking about it, and we've got all these kind of. YouTubers, not kind of YouTubers. We got all these YouTubers and normal people, because YouTubers are not normal people. No, no. Um, and you know this, that are all kind of part of the same community, the Epic Tech community. But 
the thing is, is we've got all these other YouTube channels that are kind of part of it, yours and Commander Kittens, and there's, um, and, and like there's a bunch of others that I can't that <laughs> that like that like normally are going through my head, um, but I can't for the life of me think of a, a single other Swiggy, one. I'm so sorry. Tyrell, there you go, Swoody, Tyrell, hey, and, yeah. hey. Yes, thank you. See, this is why. <laughs> <laughs> um, but the thing but is, is we all hang out together and we all kind of cross promote our channels and all that kind of stuff. And there's the, there's the, <laughs> there's the, um, shameless self-promotion channel on, on the Epic tech server that, you know, people keep an eye on and we watch each other's videos and stuff like that. And I kind of want, I would love to have the Epic tech community not be called the Epic tech community because it's more than just Epic tech. You know? Okay. So what, what kind of name would you think of? Well, like... YouTubers like, Anonymous? <laughs> yeah. There you go. Oh, my gosh. That's a great name. <laughs> um, but no, I mean, it's something that kind of brings us all together and makes this about more than just Epic Tech. Because it is. It's more than just Epic Tech. It's you guys. It's... You know, it's the Cosmic Chimp channel, and it's the Commander Kitten channel, and it's the Swooty Craft channel. It has and to be it's... YouTubers Anonymous. It has to be. <laughs> <laughs> How m I would I would be shocked if there weren't a dozen other things <laughs> called YouTubers Anonymous. <laughs> That's just it's too good of so a. So what name, names have you, know? you come up with? What kind of names have you? Oh, thought of? we had a few things like. Um, Commander Kitten came up with some like acronyms that included a bunch of them, but then I was like, well, what about other new YouTubers that join us, you know? Yeah. And then we were trying to come up with like a coalition, you know, like a, it's like the, what was it? I can't even remember. Epic it was like, Chimp Coalition or something? Or something Cosmic like that. Cosmic Tech I'm... Coalition or? <laughs> it was something along those lines, but I, I, honestly, I want. Epic pet chimp. That... <laughs> Epic <laughs> pet chimp. Uh, no, um, I actually wanted something that didn't include any of the names. No, no, no. Hey, what I was going to okay. say this: we could have the people tell us their names in the comments below. Yeah, yeah. Give us some name. Like honestly, I, I, I know that um, if anybody knows what Revel Mode is, it no longer exists. Um, but it did for a while of some of the top YouTuber channels. Um, I actually don't know very much about it. I just remember hearing about it one day, kind of, hey, look, there's this thing. Um, and I realize it's kind of like what I'm thinking, but not exactly. Okay. But I want a name that kind of says, you know, it's it it started around space engineers, but it's not going to always be about space no, engineers. No, it's about it's games not even, in general. It's games in general. It's it's gamer. It's like a group of small YouTuber gamers that all hang out together. It's like a family. Kind of, no, it is it like is. a family. It's like a family. We, we've got yeah. tech support. We've got game ideas. <laughs> we've got server people. We've got people who can help us with programming and scripting and models. Well, and I've watched and... it go way beyond that. I've watched people like, like asking for personal advice and getting it. Oh, yeah, you know? definitely. Like, and just hanging out and talking about, like, the issues. Life in the... <laughs> yeah, I mean, goofy <laughs> stuff, but serious stuff, too. <sighs> you know? And, you know, and just kind of sharing life. It's become a community as the term originally was designed. You know, like, like a village except for people from all over the world and every time zone and you know that kind of thing uh, well personally i think it's amazing like yeah me I too love it. i never expected like i wanted a community to form around epic tech i never expected it to become what it's become of all the just the so many people from so many backgrounds from so many countries from so many channels I, I honestly never thought that it would grow out to other youtube channels as well and i love it i absolutely love it and i and i just i don't i don't think it needs to be about epic tech anymore. no no it's, and it's amazing that you could actually give that up because this was this is your server this is your discord and it's amazing how 
everybody is welcomed, everybody's got such a big part, such a big say in it, and it's more than, as I say, just you, and it's amazing. And I just love the fact that, well, as I was getting back to my point, is that I'm going to randomly, spontaneously just ask people from the server to just jump on and tell me what they've got to show, what they've, about themselves, just have a laugh. And this is what the show is going to be all about, is about the Discord community and more. I want to, I want to speak to people of all aspects of gaming and ask them, like, let's see if they've got scripts for space engineers or ships, or if they just want to talk about another game, just, I want, I want to be able to show the world what our Discord people, family, are like. That's a fabulous idea. I love it. Absolutely love it. It's almost like, it's an, un, it's, it's like kind of the Tours with Epic thing, but, but instead it's just completely free form and random. And yeah. I, and that's, that's a hundred times better. I, I, was, I, I didn't I wish this. I'd come up with the idea, but you know, you did. that's okay. It was called Tech something. <laughs> tech Alicious. Oh, Tech Alicious. Well, but see, Tech Alicious is very, it's a very like aimed at a specific topic of the day or, you know, and it's, you know, and we'll have on guests, but they're going to be like pre scheduled and all this kind of stuff. I love the idea of just getting on the Discord and saying, Jump who on. wants to be part of the show you know? yeah, that's more or less and i, I want it to be yeah. so spun like for example epic didn't have a clue what was going to happen i they did just not phone them up what are you doing uh, have you got a free hour and he goes let's bargain on this free hour and I, we bargained a bit <laughs> and then i says jump on so he jumped on and then i was like Let, let's record <laughs> it was like that, and i'm that like was wait it. what record what why are we recording <laughs> what yep isn't that it's the best good. thing <laughs> it is. No, I love it. I absolutely love it. It's just, you know, it's it's random, like like some sort of, you know, loose chimp chimpanzee running through the cosmos, you know? It's just completely chaotic. Oh, my God. What? We have... We have spinners. We have spinners. We have spinners. We, we have spinners. Have spinners. <laughs> we have epic. We have spinners. Oops. I got the wrong location on that you're, you're, you're grinding up my thing. What's going on here? It's okay. It's all good. <laughs> don't, don't, don't you worry. Don't you worry. It's all good. It's, it's art. This is what you call art. Uh, let me get that. Nope. Oh, there we go. Butter toast. <laughs> You gonna ride that around? Yep. If you can manage to click on it. I want to get. Here we go. Here we go. Here you do go. realize? You do realize that? See, when we um, go into space, I'm mounting a chair to the banana. Are you really? Got it. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, I'm gonna get dizzy. Oh my gosh, this is horrible. <laughs> Oh, this is horrible. And Epic has decided to ride oh. one of his uh, fidget spinners. Oh, oh. I don't want to throw up. Okay, I'm getting off. Oh, my gosh, that's horrible. Oh, you should try that ride. Boys and girls, this is why you don't ride a fidget spinner. <laughs> <laughs> Epic spews. This, what? this what specifically is why you don't ride a fidget spinner. No, no, no. What are you doing? What? What are you going to do? There we go. What do you mean? Alright. So why have you taken the bottom off? Oh, okay. Why is it jumping? Uh, is it jumping? It was uh, jumped there. Nice. You know, I never thought about it. I wonder if there's... I wonder if that'll work. Oh no, that doesn't really work very well. <laughs> Oh. Huh. Are you going to turn up to this, uh, this stream on Saturday? What stream? The stream. <laughs> the stream we're meant to be recording. Oh, that stream. Yeah. Nah. Nah. We'll see. We'll see, maybe. So, Mr. Epic. 
Yes. What's your next big let's play do you think you'll be doing after this? After Space Engineers? Or kind of, if you want to have a you break from Space Engineers. Interstellar Rift? Interstellar Rift. Yeah, Interstellar Rift. What else have you got? Have you got any, huh? games, have you got any games that you, you've got in your wish list that you want to play? Uh... Yes. Badly. <laughs> um... I know that I know that one of these days I actually would like to do a small uh, Minecraft one again, just okay. just for fun. Um, I want to go back to Oxygen Not Included for a little bit for like another season, nice. but I kind of want to wait for a few more features to be added. They did a big update, and and I kind of wanted to start over, but I'm thinking about waiting until they do another big update or something. I don't know. Okay. Um, then let's see. There's I I just bought um, Pulsar, the Lost okay. Colony. Yeah, see, I've wanted to play that for a wee while. Yeah, that but that one I played with a friend, and it is really like single player is really crazily difficult. Like it's you're not it's not really a game at that point. Is it not meant to be uh, for groups? It is. It is meant to be for groups. Like a, a you really need a crew of at least four as far as I can tell. Now, I haven't played it very much, so somebody might be able to tell me because that I, there is some other thing, but... I've watched the uh, loads of Let's Plays, and it looks amazing. Uh, I mean, it does. Uh, it's just the whole, like, you go and be in charge of engineering, and you be the captain, and you... Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's pretty smart. I like it. I would yeah. like to try it one day. Yeah, I think that would be really fun. So, going on to this topic, then... Are you planning on becoming a full-time YouTuber? <laughs> you know, if I thought that was actually Seriously? possible... Did that just... <laughs> <laughs> well, that wasn't scary. It wasn't? Oh, I need to do it again then. <laughs> <laughs> oh, please don't. Oh, hey. What is it? It won't let me paste. Good. Do I have, like, too much in the world or something? It must be. Huh. Okay, fine. Anyway, um, I would eventually like to be, but the reality of that's pretty slim. Honestly. Nice. I mean, it would it would be cool, wouldn't it? So, what, world of YouTube. Subscribe to Epic. He's the best. <laughs> <laughs> and watch well, every you... video and every advert and thumbs up button as many times as you can to help this man out because his <laughs> content is actually amazing well i'll tell you what your hundreds of subscribers will definitely make all the difference definitely will even though they're yeah. already yours <laughs> <laughs> not all of them i'm no. sure you have a subscriber or two that doesn't subscribe to me but they will do because you're the best like honestly i love every video you do i watch every <laughs> single one of them Oh, I Except for the ones that. with Commander Kitten in them. I just seem to, you know, bypass them once. <laughs> well, I, I, don't, I don't blame you. No, I know that's not true. That's not true. Yeah. Besides, our inter our um, our Interstellar Rift series is awesome. Yeah, tell us a bit it's about really that. Fun. Tell us a bit about that. But let's do it over here. Okay, on you go. So, yeah, I mean, the, the Interstellar Rift series is a blast. It's a lot of fun. I really like that game. Like, a lot. I also feel like I should remove the giant, not so spinning thing behind you. Why? It's brilliant. This is the whole point of this. These chairs. <laughs> at least, it's at least. Let's get rid of the extra loud one. Right. No point <laughs> okay. of this chair here, is so you can paste your ship or whatever you want in the background and talk about it as it's doing what it's <laughs> doing right now. <laughs> Perfect. There you go. Right, so um, and the <laughs> so yeah, so it's I mean it's it's a game where you design your own ship and you fly around the universe, but you, the way that they do the ship design is a lot simpler. I mean, you, you could never make something like a fidget spinner. I mean, that, that's not even remotely possible in Interstellar Rift. However, in the period of an hour, I could easily make something as complicated as the MBT, and it would work better. Right, For those okay. that watch my series, they would know what the MBT is. Um, you know, a large cruiser, you can just blow out in no time. 
and you still have to do your own balancing and all that kind of stuff. But then they've done a lot more to encourage multi-crew, like many different people. Uh, for example, you can't just access every system from every terminal. You yes. have to actually walk up to the shield generator to adjust the shields. So you kind of need somebody near the shield generator if you want to modify the shields. See, that, um, but- that whole aspect, I think that's what a lot of people want. Yes, you can have what space engineers and that and have it all script and mods and stuff like that. But having an actual yeah. crew member and a crew, that sounds amazing. Like, yeah, and, just- it, and the whole multiplayer aspect just works so much better um than space engineers uh, it and it's and it's not you know it's a little bit more casual of a game i wouldn't call it by any stretch of the imagination a casual game but space engineers has a you know a pretty limited audience because not everybody wants to get into a game where they have to design their own ship from ground up and understand all of the things that are necessary to make it work with Interstellar Rift, you can play the entire game and never make your own ship. Really? Oh, because you can buy them, can't yeah. you? Yeah, you can buy them. And even if you do want to make your own ship, the barrier to entry is much lower. You could take an existing ship and just start adding things to it but very you w- easily. Would you do that? I wouldn't, no. I, I built mine from scratch. I mean, <laughs> that's But that's what I do, you know? And I learned about every single part, and I understand like how they work for the most part still figuring some stuff out mm-hmm. but um I mean, but the that's first, the nature of any game the first episode i ever seen and it was ba- very basic like you had to literally take items from one cargo container to the whatever you need to put it in is there <laughs> yep. an update that's, that you can actually now have a conveyor system when it does it itself or does it you still have to do that separately now are you referencing the the the, the episode that we just put out Maybe. <laughs> um, so yeah, there's a there's a thing called the ACTR, which um, which we call the actor, uh, and it's the automatic cargo trans relay, I think. Oh, and, nice. Yeah, and it teleports things from place to place, which is very cool. But they've done a great job of making it not ruin the game. So. You still have to maintain it. You still have to, you know, configure it, but it's simple configuration. It still needs some management, but not large amounts of management, if that makes sense. Cool. Is there piping for it? Like, will it, is it like Space Engineers? Oh. No, no, it basically... um, So if you wanted to, you could stick this at the very back of the bowels of the ship and don't need to worry about it. It'll do the job. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Anywhere on the ship, it'll teleport. You can choose what rooms and what locations. Um, it, it, no, it teleports things from place to place, anywhere on the ship to anywhere on the ship, but only one type of item per actor. Okay. So you have to manage multiples if you want to say, you know, because there's the whole refining thing. So you mine ore like iron. And then you refine it, and then you use that to make things. Just like or it sell is, it. Just as in space engineers, where you yeah. Except for objects. there's a whole economy as well, so you can buy and sell things, and you can travel from station to station, and you can even make money by buying things at one station, traveling to another one, and selling it at a higher price. It's not completely realistic because you don't know where the prices fluctuate. Right. <laughs> so, okay. so that's it's just a little kind harder of, to do. You just make but up certainly. As you go. Mining and then selling it is a completely reasonable way to make money, which is nice. Um, and then sabotage but, yeah. an enemy and then just take everything they've got. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's sabotage! <laughs> <laughs> we just put out an episode where, uh, I mean, when I say just, I mean half an hour before we're recording this. Um, the uh, We just put out this episode and we're actually considering switching to piracy. Ooh. and so we'll actually if we decide to do that we would teleport onto a ship steal everything on it teleport off and then blow it to smithereens so is this <laughs> actual other players or is it just a um, no NCB? no we wouldn't do that i mean that, that it's all in the single player game because the single player game is very detailed alive yeah there's nice. a lot more i mean like space engineers i always feel like i'm in an empty universe um 
you but know, yeah, because you don't let anybody join you. <laughs> but no, but I mean, like, okay, so they have some pirates Except from but me. Well, <laughs> um, anyway, yeah, pirates. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so there's just there's a lot more going on in the um, in the interstellar ref universe than in space engineers, but but not to say anything bad about space engineers. You can make things in space engineering oh, yeah. you never even imagine in Interstellar Rift. Like, look at these things. <laughs> in my Pointless, fingers. but pretty, totally. pretty, pretty entertaining. Yeah. S especially when you just, you know, drop on my head. <laughs> yeah. Would you like another one on your head? No, 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 please don't. You sure? Yeah, I'm fine. Because I've got one, right? Just ready for nope, it. Nope, I'm fine. Just... Oh, I know, it. I know you really want one. Yep. Oh. <laughs> I'm running away. <laughs> oh. So tell us a wee bit about your personal life, if you don't mind. <laughs> I do mind. What? What? What do you mean? Oh, just a wee bit more about you. Like this. I'm this a is all about. <laughs> okay, I've got what? two eyes, a nose. Okay. Two legs. What, what underwear are you wearing? <laughs> uh, I wear boxer briefs. <laughs> Not wide fronts. Um, well, they, well, I mean, they're, they're boxer briefs, so they do have wide fronts. So they're like, um, they're like, but uh, they're not tidy whiteies. <laughs> <one. laughs> oh, I bet you're one of these guys that goes to the beach with white socks and sandals and <laughs> an umbrella. Uh, no, I, I normally wear jeans, actually. <laughs> jeans and tennis shoes. <laughs> and an umbrella, yes. I don't like the sun. The sun is not something that agrees with me for the most part. Epic went to Hawaii, am I right in saying that? I, and I um, yeah. took his laptop and gamed most of the time when his family were enjoying the, the not beach. Not most of the time, but okay. Little, yeah. all the time. <laughs> <laughs> That's not true. I did game a little bit. Oh, look at that. Oh, I can hear the banging. <laughs> You know a backup of this world, right? Yeah, I hope so. <laughs> you hope so? I hope so. Let's see. I think we're going to need one of these. Yeah, definitely. We can also go into space and have a look at that one. Have a look at what one? My space station. I've got the exact same base up in space. So, okay. There's always one guy. Is that, is, that, is, that your, is that your way of telling me it's the end of the show? <laughs> um, no, no, this is my way of telling you it's the end of your set. <laughs> oh, okay, there's always one. I'm going to let him do this. I'm going to let him. What do you him. mean? I'm not even going to. I'm not even going to stop. I'm just going to let it happen. And this is what happens when you get cosmically epic together. <laughs> Ooh, did I get you? No. And this here is actually fan art that was made for me by a good friend of mine. And I, okay, and that ruined it. I'll get more into that later. <laughs> I'm stuck. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I'm getting a where, where are you? Hello. Oh, there you are. All right, blow me up then. Come on, hurry up. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna set any of these off. All right, I thought you were. No, yeah. I'd have to arm them all into that. That's boring. <laughs> yeah, so I've got a space station that we can have a look at if you want. Oh, okay. Right. Do you want to take the the long way or the shortcut? Do you have a, Do you have a shortcut? Yeah, just kill yourself. <laughs> oh, okay. And oh. here we have it, guys. This is the space station with open doors and plenty of oxygen. Plenty of oxygen, huh? Yeah. Right, so this is the cosmic show in space. So the basis of this is so that if you've got a space station or a ship, you can come up here, post it in the background, and we can... <laughs> oh, that's just lovely jubbly. What? I'm not bored. I'm gonna sit okay. over here and wait until you're ready. I'm falling. 
<laughs> Don't worry, I'm coming back. I just love the skybox. Yeah, I found my way up. <laughs> and it was at that moment, Cosmic realized Epic was on. Anyway, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Family friendly. <laughs> Did you watch the stream That's from right. the, the what I've called as um, the stream that Epic never turned up to? <laughs> Which I did, by the way. All of it, or just some of it, or do you pan okay. through it? I'm not bothered. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's that puke green. So this guy is, is Epic's um, lovely balcony, as you can see. <laughs> yeah, so did you watch the stream, yeah? You enjoyed it? Not the whole thing. No. Pointless castle. This is the whole point. This is where I got the whole idea for the Cosmic Show. It was just from that ending of that stream where we were just talking and it was brilliant. It was just a laugh. So I thought <laughs> that's why I wanted it spontaneously just to just hit people up and go, right, guys, let's record and talk let's do nonsense. it now. Show up. Do it fast. I'm impressed. I'm actually land I'm actually falling at a hundred and oh, hundred and eleven point five six meters per second. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> what? Nine. You setting up a trap for me nope. or something? You'll see when you land. Okay. Once you find the base in space, you Speaking know of which, you might want to be looking, because here I come! Oh! What were you on? <laughs> I've been dropping warheads the entire time. I come in with a warhead. Yeah. Destroy cosmic show. Hey, come on, join me. Where are okay. you? Anyway, boys and girls. This is the end of the sh cosmic show. Thank you for watching. Please put that thumbs up button, just punch it for me, and leave a comment. Let me know if you like this show. If you want any questions to ask Epic, and we we'll might do another one. Uh, we'll definitely have another guys on, so stay tuned for that. And uh, as always, stay safe. <laughs> <I'm waiting. laughs> What? This is gonna hurt, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> uh, there you go.